back to title contention and a heavyweight championship opportunity for this man but he has put in all the right work and a lot of people give him a great chance to get the job done tonight you know when you've been there and you get back here it's not new there are a lot of things that are familiar but how do you change the result how do you assure that in this time during this chance you ultimately walk away with the championship He's been here before, John. The team's been here before. They are confident that this time they get it done. And that self-belief is rooted in the preparation, right? He's got speed. He's got power. All the tools to rest the belt away. We'll see if we have a new UFC heavyweight champion by night's end. Folks, here we go, undisputed UFC heavyweight championship fight, and all eyes are on the incumbent as he makes the walk here tonight, and he's enjoying every moment of it. Huge title defense beckons for him tonight. John, he loves where he stands in the sport. He loves the admiration that comes with being the baddest man on the planet. He knows he's the biggest, he's the strongest, he's the baddest, and he loves it. And he prepares as if he never wants to let that go. This man lives for being the best. This man lives to be in the spotlight. And time and time again, we see him defend this belt as if his life depended on it. Well, right, you lose this belt, it's essentially like walking back into your new life. He has no intention of suffering that fate here tonight. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight championship fight. We send it inside the octagon. Here's Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. <laughs> Fighting out of the blue corner, presenting the challenger, the warrior. And now, introducing the champion, fighting out of the red corner, ladies and gentlemen, presenting the reigning, defending, undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Dynamite. Herb Dean, our referee for this one. Scheduled for five rounds if need be. Opens with the left hand and lands flush. All right, early round one here. Big reach advantage, DC. We'll see if he can employ that patented jet. Yes, he has to maintain distance. He's the taller guy. So every time his opponent tries to enter, he's going to have to take something on the way inside. Cannot take those leg kicks clean like that. Oh, nice kick. Oh, 
with a straight right hand. That'll work. And that's, that is the danger in the engagement there. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. Oh, beautiful technique on that straight punch. Great job moving into his opponent and getting to that single call. Nice straight right lands. Oh, he jumped guillotine right away. Oh, yeah, he's got him. He's so tight. Oh, how good is that as he gets out? That is great submission defense, keeping everything short and not allowing his opponent to get the submission victory. Lands the grounded pound strike here. Might be a submission attempt here, Jim. I mean, you cannot sit in a full guard. When you sit in the full guard, you give these guys so many opportunities. Making all these shots count. And there it is. Another strike on the ground gets through. Oh, good shot landed there from the bottom. Inside the closed guard now. I mean, he went right into his full guard. What does he do to try to advance himself to give him more of an advantage on the mat? All right, we'll see if he can apply pressure inside his opponent's guard here, DC. A lot of top pressure being applied here as he works out of side control. All right, so you got to be careful playing on the ground with this guy. You don't want to mess around for too long. Oh, deadly hook. He is getting lit up. His face already has a big old cut on the side. Oh, that's it, my boy. Moving to his left now. Well, I'm no fighter, but if I rock a guy to that extent, I feel like I'm closing the show. Absolutely. You got to go close the show if you get a guy hurt that bad. You cannot back off and take your time. He's right for the picker. Go and pick the fruit. <laughs> Man, these guys have some chins on them. Huge shots being landed on both sides. And now a left. Big right hand. Good defense blocking that punch. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. Well, he has stayed busy and he has stayed accurate. Nice combination. Very accurate, a lot of activity, and the hands look phenomenal, man. That is a clean strike, and it gets right through the guard. Nice kick. These guys are going at it. Nice job defensively. He blocked that punch. Another strike hits that eye area, and it is getting messier by the minute up there. Well, he's getting targeted now. He's been hitting that spot so many times. As the opponent sees the cut, and the cut is advancing. All right, looks as though that strike maybe opened up a cut around the eye area. Yeah, it looks like that strike opened up a cut, John, but it's nothing to worry about now. But he's got to start to protect it. Oh, and he lands another knee there, DC. It doesn't always... Oh! He's got to move. They're going to stop this fight if he doesn't move. Minutes down. All right, there's the horn. The round is over, but not before he was cut on his nose from the strikes in that round. Back to the stool. Cut man is in. Should be able to shut that cut and prevent it from becoming an issue moving forward. But, of course, as soon as he gets struck in that next round, it could open back up. All right, so let us now check out some of the action in that round, DC. There was a whole lot of it, including a stunner upstairs that nearly closed the show. It was a lot of action. It was back and forth action, but the big moment was that big strike to the head that landed that put him on wobbly legs and then survival mode. Luckily, he made it to the end of that round. You ready to fight? You ready? Second round on the way. Great defense on this play there. Oh, he got it. Back to the feet now. Big knee there to the chest. Now some separation. to continue to attack that 
cut, and it's getting wider by the minute. It's getting wider by the minute. This guy is, is, is a fantastic fighter, and he's as smart as that cut. So the moment that cut opened up, you knew that that would become his focus, and we are seeing it very clear right now. Useful strike there. The hook is clean. Well, it's been a wild fight thus far. Perhaps a contender for some bonus money at fight's end. These guys are going to have to dig deep. They're both hurt. They're both hurt. You expected it. You expected a close fight. You did not expect a war like this. Oh! Oh, another knockdown! Right back! Well, we may have the best cut men and women in the business, but I'm not sure they're going to be able to do much with that cut. It continues to widen with every passing. I mean, you gotta be kidding me with that knockout. If that is not the number one play on Sports Center tonight, I'm not sure what would top it. One of the best knockouts we've seen all year. In a very long time. I have not seen someone look this good. He promised us something and he delivered with that beautiful knockout. Inside the octagon, Bruce Buffer has the official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Dean has called a stop to this contest at one minute, 36 seconds of round number two. Declared the winner by knockout and still the undisputed UFC heavyweight champion of the world, Dynamite. So the celebration is on, and it figures to continue deep into the night for the UFC heavyweight champion, and still after the knockout victory here tonight. And given all this man has accomplished, I think you can still argue that tonight is the crowning achievement of his mixed martial arts career, knocks out the number one contender with style points to retain his heavyweight title. Congratulations to champion, coach, team, family on the big result here tonight.